activate, activate the nine pillars that govern the observatory. Glassy Labolas, Bune, Rovane, Berith, Astaroth, Foras, Asmode, Gap. We nine pillars smell the scent of time. We nine pillars follow phenomena. In the name of the 72 demon gods, we will not allow this aggression to cease. Billy the Kid. Here comes North America. Oh no, it's uh, Drake. Never mind. Okeanos. Hold it right there. From here to the future, from now to, to the past, all of this belongs to us. What I'm getting at is that this is our territory, and we're gonna give a, and you're gonna give us everything you've got, including your lives. I know we've got no business showing up like this and being so pushy, but we can't help it. We're pirates. Wow, so cool, boss. Yeah, let's have some fun like always, mateys. No matter who we're fighting against or what we're fighting, what we do never changes. We pillage, we drink, and we party. The boss. Uh, we know we're you're like a ghost or something, but how come you're not back to life too? We worry about the details when you drop dead. Also, I ain't no ghost. You ever see a ghost with a body like this? <laughs> you bonehead skywax, don't you remember that the boss doesn't like ghosts? But don't you dare think of us think of using that to scare her. She'll shoot a ghost right in the face without a second thought. By the way, that's how I got the side patch. Wow, this is completely useless information to be giving me now that I'm dead. Okay, gunners, throw Bombay into the cannons and fire him at the meat pillar. Ah, please, no, I'll do my job. Come on, quit slacking off and work, man. Also, I don't know what's going on, but we got dragged into this mess too. Yeah, it looks like they were stuck through her life and death. You got it, we're sailors of the Golden Hind. We'll follow the captain wherever she goes. Yarr. Hmm? Captain, I see a new ship off the starboard bow. That's Queen Anne's Revenge. <laughs> I see, I see. So he's come too. Annoying, but he's okay in a fight. No, no, Blackbeard. No, go away. Hey, Blackbeard, can you hear me? Where are you? <laughs> I shall be the one to defeat you. I can't let anyone else be the one to. You, especially, we reject. We <laughs> repudiate. Okay, even they want Blackbeard dead. <sighs> no, Blackbeard, just 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 go die. We 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 got you don't get a super cool monologue. You're not super cool. Wow, and the captain's lecturing the demon gods on what is appropriate as a human. I'm not sure which one of us is worse. Still, I didn't think you two would answer my call. Did I trigger some flags without me knowing? <sighs> You've got some death flags popping up right now. Well, to be completely honest, your pirate crew wasn't the worst we've ever been with. It wouldn't it would be better if we were deployed with Captain Drake, though. Oh well, nothing for it. We have to put up with you, again. Right, compromise and settle. Compromise and settle. Well, I'm being treated as the guy they settled for. Well, that's some, that's some in real life women for you. You're pushing our deals on women too much. What? He talked? Come on, Captain. Hector's not here. It's just us and your men on the ship, which means that we should fight along with the Golden Hind. Captain Drake has sent you a message that, that to that effect as well. I, I know that. I was just go about to answer. Tora, Tora, Tora. Basically, I'm telling them to. I'm telling them I'm down for whatever. Roger, Captain. Fighting together. Fighting together with Francis Drake. You seem to be having a. You seem to have a trouble, con trouble controlling your excitement, Captain. Our Captain is a hopeless dummy. He's so childish. Shut up. All right, men. We'll match our movements with the old, uh, I mean, uh, Drake's ship. What they do? What do they think they are stealing uh, pirates' treasure? I don't care if they're demon gods or plain old devils. They'll regret stealing the treasure from Super Pirate Blackbeard uh, when I send them to hell. All right. Even that moron's ready to fight. Men, don't you dare lose. If we sink, if we sink before that fool, you'll spend the rest of your eternity cleaning the ships in hell. Aye, aye, Captain. Golden Hind, ready the main cannons. Queen Anne's Revenge, ready the main cannons. Fire! <laughs> I came by. Hey, you there? Don't just casually stroll in like some schoolgirl returning from the city. Damn it, we came. We came. And hold on a sec. Huh. You think you can turn me back to a proper form, Miss Lady Artemis? 
Coming to the temple in this form seems really, really inappropriate. Are the creepy squid legs over there looking at me? Like, what's this? Are they? Are they? No, it's not what you think. This fluffy form is all that goddess's fault. Aw, but I'm worried. And you know, the way the Greek goddess is, is to stick uh, someone uh, to the ends of hell once they've gotten involved. Master's doing his best, so he'll be rewarded with some of my special services. Oh, well, it's good for a goddess like you to be interested in something. At least, I'd like to believe that. I mean, it's typical of, in Greek myth fashion for a person uh, pretty reliable to end up dying in a horrible way by the gods <laughs> when the gods get interested in them. Aw, don't sweat the small stuff. Okay, darling, pop on my head. <sighs> Fine, whatever. Just so we're clear, I'll be the one giving the orders. You don't need to... You don't need to use that puny head of yours. Just keep firing your bow. Okay, come on, darling. Uh, follow me to the ends of the earth, okay? Okay. I can't hear you. Okay, right, off we go. No, it's so no Medea Lily. Okay. Okay, Fornius. Hmm. Big purple squid looking thing.
All right, finish him off, Iskandar. Oh, it's still alive. Alright, solid hit, but that's not enough. It's not nearly enough. Once the enemy's hurt, it's time to turn up the heat. We still got more rounds, right? Aye, aye, Captain. We brought as much as we could. Good. Alright, Gabriel, get going. If the stars are in the sky, then you can use them to guide your path. There's only room for us here. We... fine... here. That's... yeah. Good luck, Master. That's right. Not, not only am I Uriel here, but so am I, Steno. Well, that Medusa-less hero is here too, I guess. That means that you can buy, we can buy you infinite time. Come, Asterios. Yeah, get on my shoulders. Yeah. Let's go, me, Steno. This is a good opportunity to see who's the best hunter. Don't overdo it. <laughs> not ha happening. We're both going to work super hard to be reckless. There are many times when we can really let loose without being considerate. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna kick some butt, too. Yeah! Going well is fine, but remember, you're still my ride. Oh, sorry. I won't go too hard. Alright, Uriel. Hmm? What is it? Send everyone off with a song. Something that will cheer up Gabriel. Or cheer Gabriel on. Oh, request? How wonderful. Just for today. Okay, then. Gabriel, don't stop moving because my song attracts you. Aw, they're so lucky. They get to flirt with Uriel Chan over there. So lucky. I want to play with her too. I want to play. No, Blackbeard, you die. But I will turn my resentment into power. Come on, let's kill the stupid squid thing. I am not a squid. I am a ray. You especially are unacceptable. <laughs> Why am I the only one you keep talking to like that? Uh, did, do you think I'm one of you or something? Wow, scary. Okay, I'm scared. I'm definitely going to kill you. Hey, eyes, nose, no nose, just eyes, eyes, and eyes. And that thing's got nothing but eyes. He does look kind of powerful when he does things like that. A lot of guys look cool until they open their mouths. Eric in particular surprised me, since he's still a king. Should we speak to him more po more politely? Nah, there's no need for that now. For your information, I'm one of those guys who should keep his mouth shut too. Then why do you only make garbled screams and weird voices the whole time? Gun healed. I gets upset if I talk to other women. It's fine if she gets upset, but something but sometimes she curses them. I didn't expect to hear that much of a dark side of a happy couple at a time like this. It doesn't matter. I'm always someone does a berserker. So it works. Anyways, I'm off to go fight a bit more. Kill, kill, kill! Huh, Eric's going postal there. Guess I better join in. Feels like we're late to the game. As the heroines of Blackbeard's Pirates, we can't lose this fight. Aye, aye, that's right. We'll crush our foes just like we did in the last battle. But things are different this time. Our captain may be an idiot, but he puts himself on the front line. Aye, right indeed. Ah, my butt! My butt's on fire! Bucket! 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 He really is an idiot, though. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay, it's calmed down a little. Yep, yep. Leave the rest to me and relax. By the way, Abishag, I found this lovely island. Let's go visit it when the battle is over. 
I'm not Abishag. No, it's okay. To me, any pretty girl I see is Abishag. It's a wonderful thing. <laughs> wow, that is really not okay. Get out there and fling some stones. No, that's not even a that's not even a drop of alcohol, you drunk. Aw, you're all fun. I suppose there's nothing I can do. This is a perfect time to show Gabriel uh, how I how this is a perfect time to show Gabriel that I can be trusted. I'll do it and I'll do it well. Even if, supposedly, my foe is my son. Or at least someone claiming to be. Darling! Were you watching? Were you? That was so cool, wasn't I? Oh yeah, yeah. You're very cool. Yeah. Say it like you mean it. You're making me super mad. Can you stop talking like an airhead? It's damaging the reputation of goddesses everywhere. You might be okay with it, but the other goddesses are complaining. To me, uh, look, I, I have four letters from them. It's fine to be all lovey dovey, but keep, but keep her on a shorter leash. All moon goddesses are dippy. Please get a room. You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> are you tell, are you telling me you're cheating on me? No, absolutely not. Stop giving me that vacant, ditzy look. Okay, okay. Look, the enemy's over there. Darling, let's have a long talk later, okay? Everything's fine. Don't worry. You're the only one I love. I mean it, really. You're the only one for me. Well, even if there's no love between you two, aren't you fully... Uh, aren't you fulfilled physically? Ah, uh, sleeping with a pretty girl is nice. Uh, no better way to rest one's cold, weary bones. Oh yeah, David, you know all about that, boy. You know all about that. Yeah, there have been some tasty moments. Wait, what did I just say? Yep, once this battle's over, let's be happy together. Maybe at the bottom of the sea. That's double suicide! No way! <laughs> it's okay, I can still keep going. Even if there's a weird king who's trying to seduce me, or a goddess I worship is starting, is starting a stupid lover's quarrel, I won't let that get me down. The children smiles. Everything like that. It's all giving me energy. Now who's next? You? You? Come at me! Even without the protection of my goddess, I am still energized enough to take out a Saladonian borer right now. But you know, I wish I had better companions. I would have taken even that stupid speedster. Ah, damn it! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! No, I'm gonna live! No, I'm gonna die! Damn it all! What's got into me? A chance to restore my name, huh? I was drawn into... I was drawn in by that promise and end up summoned to a place like this. I'm a heroic spirit who fights with wisdom and courage. I don't want to fight on a battlefield where there's ten times more enemies than us. I want to win the easy way. Uh, so, I want, so I'm going home. My home turf is a place where I don't have to think about anything. Um, Lord Jason, wasn't it our bond that summoned you here? I was delusional. Delusional. I let you drag me here. I understand how Her uh, Her Heracles feels now. I can't understand what he says, but I feel him. Damn you, Hera. Why am I stuck here even after becoming heroic spirit? Once more. Once more. I want to do over. I want to restart my adventure smarter and stronger. It's okay. I'll protect you, Lord Jason. Hector's here too, right? Right, right. Defensive battles are my specialty. Me and the Argonauts can hold the line for a while. Huh? Are you idiots? I mean, maybe Medea is, but you too, Hector? Don't go all stupid on me. And you call yourself the Guardian of Troy? You and Medea both need to go support Heracles, now! Clear path for him so we can concentrate on offense. Huh? What about defending this place? Are you willing to sacrifice our one-time hope of victory, idiots? Listen, it's just this is just a simple math problem. Instead of turning 1 into 10, it's much better if we turn 10 into 100. Make the Argonauts a 10, we'll be toast. We better, we'll be better a million times off by making Hercules 100. Right, Heracles? It may be completely out of your mind, but we're talking about war. And you know what I'm saying? That's right. You guys back Heracles up. And I'll wait here. It's a pain in the butt, but I'll show you how to use the sails. <sighs> Hector, you look completely bewildered. That's my lord, Jason. When Jason gets big-headed, he can really turn into a total loser. And that's when we put him under a ton of pressure, and when he starts to get anxious about his life. He gets really smart, and really cool. Um, I mean, that's part of it, but... It's just that I finally figured out why this old man ended up on your side in Okeanos. Ah, oh, yes, I see. They're a lot alike. By the way, he only shows his stuff as a hero when he's under a ton of pressure. Yep, just like my dumb little brother. 
Their looks are, and personality is completely different, though. Anyway, let's try to... Let's not try to bond... Let's try not to let the bond before it slip away. Yes, we'll support you, Heracles. I, Medea, will support and strengthen you with everything I have. Show them the power of the famous hero of myth. Dead axe. See you, Captain Jason. Just stay here for a bit and wait for the good news. Idiot. There's not going to be any good news. We were sent here to be chewed up and spit out. Ah, damn it. I'm going to die for nothing again, I bet. I can't believe it. I never thought I'd see the day when you'd impress me. Not since I became a heroic spirit. I'm speechless. Huh? Um, that voice. I was just saying that you did the right thing. The best thing you can do here is let Heracles fight to his fullest. <sighs> I have a bond with Gabriel, so I shall help you out a bit as well. Ah, it's the real one! Okay, that made my head hurt. The Medea over there is real too. It's true that we both come here to die, but our job is to delay the, the enemy for every second possible. You're the captain. I can protect you for a short while. Use that time to move the Argonauts to distract them. Now get to it! You're better with the sails than Heracles, aren't you? Damn it, what a nightmare! Two of them! Two of them at once! This is a dream. I hope I can wake up soon. Come, Gabriel. Get a move on. The wind won't be at your back forever. <laughs>